Hey buddies, we're gonna get started on 11-7. The topic today is gonna to be mental map, different uh, ways to find the missing part parts. We've seen this, but we haven't seen it for a while. It's our part, part, whole. Okay, so the whole is 700. One part is 260. I need to find this missing part. Okay, so one way to find the missing part would be to count on by hundred, very hundreds, very similar to last lesson where we counted back. I like to count forward. It's easier for my brain because that's how my brain works. So I'm going to count forward from 260. I'm going to count on by one hundreds. Okay. So 260, 360. I'm going to pause. I cannot go above 700. If I'm finding the missing part, I cannot go above 700. So I'm going to go 260, 360. 460, 560, 660. Now I know that 600 is right before 700. If I go to 760, it's gonna be too much. So when I get to my biggest jumps after 100, I'm gonna drop it down here. Now I'm gonna jump by 10. So 660, I'm gonna stop again at 700. 670, 680, 690, 700. Now, I need to know how many jumps I took. That's great. That's great that I got to 700, but I need to make sure that the amount of jumps that I took were correct, okay? So I have 100, 200, 300, 400. So I made a jump of 400 up here. And then I counted by 10. So I went 10, 20, 30, 40. I can easily tell that 400 plus 40 is 440. So, my uh, missing part is gonna be 440, 260 plus 440 equals 700, and then I'm gonna fill in my missing part over here. Capiche? Um, and that is it for today, cuties. So, and they actually like leave spaces for you to make the jump, so try to practice that. It tells you to count on by 100s and then by 10s. Just don't forget to um, make sure you tally this part up at the end, because that's where, um, that's gonna be a missing step that I could foresee you forgetting to do. So after you make your jumps of 100, then you make your jumps of 10, go back and count how many jumps you made. Got it? I hope you have a wonderful day and I will talk to you soon. Bye.